Hey guys, this is Chris from Empire Bricks and welcome to another LEGO Star Wars review. Today I have something really special to share with you. This is my very first custom minifigure. It's the first one I have ever bought and um, it's Tion Midon from uh, Utapau. So if you don't remember, he is the character um, that um, greets Obi-Wan Kenobi on the planet Utapau. So he is an a Powan, as you could say, and he is the port administrator um, at Pau City, which is on uh, Huta Pau. So this is um, my first, uh, my very first uh, custom minifigure, um, and I'm really excited. As soon as I saw this, I wanted to buy it. Um, it is made by uh, A Star Bricks. Um, I have left a link to his Instagram account and his eBay page where you can purchase this figure below this video. Uh, but let's dive in and have a look at all the details that we have here. So um, there is actually some um, combination of printing and decals here on the front. So this bottom piece is actually a um, uh, original Lego piece, as is the body and hands. Um, so that that's awesome. That they're custom printed, um, and there is a custom jacket and a custom head. Now, um, when I say custom, um, I mean they are 3D printed, so they are completely unique pieces. Um, you can actually see that this is um, painted in two different colors, so there is some darker color in between the indents and then uh, painted over by red. Now, I have to say that um, you can actually pretty clearly see that this is not a um, Lego piece, but in my humble opinion, that doesn't really matter. It looks absolutely awesome. So um, yeah, I couldn't be happier to um, have this on this figure and it makes the whole thing come uh, across very authentic. So um, the head is another thing. Um, as you can imagine, the character has a very elongated head, um, which is pretty hard to realize uh, or, or to create with uh, regular Lego pieces. So this 3D printed head, it's basically the same as a Lego head, but a little bit taller and without the uh, stud. And I think that looks much, much cooler. And let's see how far we can uh, zoom in to have some detail on the face. So you can see that there are some vertical stripes that are very fine and very small. It's extremely hard to get them sharp on, uh, on the camera, but um, the, the gray part on the top of the head is actually a whole bunch of vertical um, uh, stripes. So uh, that is actually how the character looks. And I think it's amazing that that small detail um, has come across on the print and uh, decal. I think this is a combination as well. Uh, the eyes are completely awesome. And I totally love the, the teeth that you can, well, they are there, they're very small, um, but there's just so much detail in in the face. So um, on the back, there's actually no printing, uh, which is not a problem in my opinion. Um, uh, but I think this just totally looks great. Um, so this is actually a character that um, Lego never made a um, a minifigure for, uh, which is kind of you know logical. It's only um, on screen for a few seconds, I guess. But I've always been intrigued by this uh, species, and when I saw that someone had created a custom minifigure of it, uh, I really had to have it. Now. When it arrived, it actually had a, a crushed bottom piece, which probably happened um, by uh, unsafe handling by one of the postal services. So I contacted the seller and he was kind enough to uh, supply me with a free replacement piece. So I'm very happy with that. Great service. And he also said that in the future he will use a small um, plastic boxes to make sure that never happens again. Um, the figure itself, uh, the price is fourteen ninety in uh, English pounds, so I would say that's about seventeen fifty in euros and eighteen nineteen dollars, excluding shipping. Um, the seller is in the UK, so um, just some extra information uh, for if you would like to buy this figure. Um, now, I would like to say that uh, go check out his eBay page. He has more figures than just this one. Um, and they're all awesomely detailed and uh, totally worth uh, having a look at. So that's it for this uh, minifigure review. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did like this video, please like, comment and subscribe and I will see you all next time.